Howdy, and welcome back to the Texas Bucket List. And who doesn't love llamas? I mean, seriously. The big fluffy ears, the protruding teeth that provide the perfect smile make these gentle giants a unique animal to be around. So when we found out a place that's dedicated to our furry friends, we knew we had reached Shangri-Lama. Troy City may not have rolling green hills and rainbows, but out in rural Rockwall County is a really big residence that's right out of Ireland. When looking for homes, you definitely chose the most <laughs> normal looking Texas residence. Yes, didn't we? Yes. Coming from California, Sharon and her husband Paul were looking for something kooky because they needed a home with lots of space for their whole furry family. We checked it out and didn't know, oh, it's also a castle. It's like, okay, where's the decision here? A llama castle? It's the biggest dog I've ever seen. Yeah. <laughs> Llamas are what this woman loves. They're just odd. Yeah, yeah. They're odd. Well, this whole thing's odd. A castle with llamas. I know. You do that with any of our llamas. Not exactly what you'd expect from a retired ghost writer. I thought I'd just be chilling, watching movies, and going to ladies' clubs. And I did that for a little while, and I got bored. <laughs> Sharon's son Tommy was allured to llamas too. He was infatuated with these curious creatures after a school trip to a zoo, and that started everything. Before he knew it, they opened Shangri Llama to share in the love of llamas. At some point, do you even look at it and go like, this is ridiculous, I can't believe we're doing this. <laughs> Every day. <laughs> Every day. Having such unique pets patrolling their Irish palace is already peculiar enough, but Sharon went above and beyond by giving her fuzzy friends funny names. Dalai Lama was something kind of mystical, magical, creepy, whatever, eyes, you know, something that draws your attention. Bahama Lama, some Lama that's just chill. His personality is just laid back. Drama Lama, a dramatic looking guy. Pajama, just because we needed for the Lama Lama Red Pajama Storybook to have a, a namesake for that. Then we got Komoteyama. Now he's a funny dude. He was the star of a show called Llama Cop. Seriously? Serious, I know. It totally sounds like I'm making this up. Yeah. The life of a llama is a curious one, full of unique facts. Native to South America, they can each carry up to 100 pounds, and the hierarchy in their pack is curious to see firsthand. Yeah. Very interesting, the yes. group dynamics of llamas. It I never is. realized. It is. The pack mentality is fascinating. A higher ranking llama gets to boss around their lower ranking ones, and the lower ones aspire to be higher ranking. So there's that friction there, but it gives them something to do. Taking pictures is another thing that comes naturally to llamas. They're very social. They like people. They don't like us hugging them the way a dog does, and that's surprising to most people. You can see the whites of their eyes, take pictures, take a selfie with them, but once you start hugging them and hanging on them, they do pull back. They like personal bubbles. They do. They have their bubble. Mm. That bubble goes away when you have crackers. You've got triscuits. I do. You feed these things triscuits? Yeah, they like triscuits. Just the plain ones. <laughs> just the plain triscuits? Yeah. They just eat them out of your hand or how you do this? No, in my mouth. You want to see? Mouth? Uh -huh. <laughs> I, then I get a little taste. There you go. I got them. Well, you're getting close to that. It looked like a kiss, but he didn't. He would like more. Looks like I've got one more thing to check off the list. I'm very nervous. Llama kisses. Why do you think people are so enamored by these things? I think because they're both beautiful and goofy in the same moment. You know, usually you're one or the other, but they're beautiful to look at. And then you've got this head on a long pole and these big eyes and they're looking around and it's just, it, it's just an interesting combination. So if peace and tranquility combined with a crooked smile and crazy selfies is what you're looking for, Shangri-Lama achieves nirvana on the Texas bucket list. People rarely get to be around a pack of llamas. Pure joy when they come in and see a room full of these beautiful animals. And that's why we do it.
The Texas Bucket List is brought to you by Spirit of Texas Bank. Texans helping Texans. Slovacek Sausage. You'll love our sausage. Experience Bryan College Station. And Seaforce Natural Artesian Water by Chuck Norris.